How's it going, everyone? I have a package I'm going to be opening here in about eh, 30 seconds. Tomorrow I have something else I'm going to open too, but today I have something particular that I want to open, see what it looks like, show what's in the contents of this box compared to some other things I have. But first I got to get my, my opening device. What's up, Jen? How you doing, baby? I love you. Here we go. Gonna slice this open. See what's in this box. And keep it cutting away from me. All times cut away. Just trying to make sure I ain't showing the label or nothing. But there. Cut away from yourself. Now let's see. Let's see what kind of good, efficient packaging we get. Alright. Alright. Get the one thing out here. Got two items. And got the other. I think we'll start off with, let's see. Okay, okay. Start off with Beast Man. It's the new ones, the origin style for filmation style. What's up, Anthony Michael? How you doing? But, yep, got this, and I got He Man. But, all right, all right. Now they have a, the reason I have like, uh, I have other Origins bodies by me. I don't have the Beastman Origins body by me, but I have a different filmation style one for just a five and a half inch comparison. But it's like a different body I think they've done for like the torso. So it'll be. And how's it going, Tom? Uh, Tom Doolittle. Tomorrow I got something I'm going to be opening and it's from him. But Tom, today I'm doing something separate. Then tomorrow I'll do yours. Which I can't thank you enough for. But let's get this sucker out. But we got Filmation Style Beast Man. Wait. I thought I dropped his whip. Nope. Okay. Just want to see how different these bodies. What's up, Moises? And I am not seeing comments. So if you guys are com or, you know, commenting right now, I apologize. But I want to see what the leg design and everything is. How it is different. What do we got? Came with the hover ray from the diamond ray of disappearance. It's got his whip, but let's see this torso that they're talking about. Like I'll just grab a Yeah, I can see like the style is different. The legs, yeah, even the legs, like the muscularity on the legs is different as well. So it, it's it's still, you know, under the origins label, but now the new uh you could say filmation style line that's coming out, but looks pretty cool. I'm impressed. I'm impressed. Looks good. The Beastman face. I like the face. I like it a lot more than Super 7 put out their five and a half inch ones years ago. And, you know, you can see the difference. I mean, I know some people still might like this more and more power to them, but you know, some of the head always looked way too big and out of proportion on the Super 7 one, but I like this. Yeah, that is pretty cool. That is cool. So it's good to know that we'll be getting filmation style figures, you know, coming in uh, 2024 at stores. And hopefully that means we'll get characters that we never had before, like Malaktha and so many others. But, yeah, I like this. That That's a cool figure. But the He-Man one, this is the one I'm looking forward to seeing and comparing a lot of stuff. I want to see other things, so... Oh, it said he has the Sword of the Ancients in this here, too. I think that's what, Masks of Power episode? And that's when I always tell everybody, I was like, He-Man's sword is the most powerful sword, which makes him even more powerful. Because when the Sword of the Ancients, remember, that is the second most powerful item on all of Eternia. It merged with his Sword of Power to become one. So that means He-Man has even more power. And his sword is even more powerful. So, just a little nerd moment for me. But let's see. Not bad. I'm trying to look at this eye placement. I always wonder, I don't know if it's their way of trying to, because I'm looking at another figure I have. If they're trying to represent him looking up, like when he's, you know, when he gets the power, you know, after transforming. But sometimes that eye placement thing is weird, but. Okay. Now I'm going to try to compare this over with the, uh, well, first. Got his power sword and the sword of the ancients, so that's pretty cool. That's cool. But 
All right, first the regular, oh, God forbid, Origins figure with that moronic head. So, I mean, I, I like it. It's good. It's just something about, he looks like he's looking up. But still, I like this. And it is a different body style. Like I said, still the same height. Basically, he might be a little bit taller. But it seems like it says the same articulation in all the spots. But there are differences with the, the muscles. And even in the legs, again, with the legs... The upper body, even bits to the arm, look slightly different. But I like that. But now I want to compare it next to, remember when they had that uh, box set and they did a Filmation He-Man? The one where he's doing the duck face for some reason? I don't understand that <laughs> face. But that almost looks like the same harness, but it's different legs. Everything else is different. But uh, I like this head a lot <laughs> better than this head. And I just noticed... Uh, Let's see, I'm, I don't know. I think it's the same sword. They reused the same sword. So they used the sword that they had in that pack. But, uh, yeah, if I was to go with one that looks better, it is, uh, oh, yeah, and it looks like even the same thing with the back. Yeah. But, uh, yeah, this is cool. Just knowing, like I said, a Filmation line is coming. And there's so many more things and hopefully things that we never got before. But I like, yeah, I like it. And I'm just trying to see if the harness is the same. It looks damn close. I think it is just, you know, they changed up the color a bit. But the harnesses, I think, are the exact same harness. But this head is much better than the duck. F I don't get it. I don't I don't understand this head for that one box set. But these are awesome. They're awesome. Not looking at the mini comic because I just don't have faith in any of these. All the other mini comics suck, so why would this be any different? Didn't they have the janitor writing them or something? I don't know. The guy that files... I don't know, the paperwork. They had somebody write the original mini-comic that came with the first sh shitty Origins He-Man. So it's like, I don't even look at these no more. I don't care. And I don't know who's doing the art on the back of the cards. I don't look at that either. I just look at the figures. But And again, I can't see any comments. So if people are commenting, I apologize. But, I yeah, I like the Beast Man. Yeah, that is a nice face. That's That's a good, that's a good design. It doesn't look like crap. Everything about him looks cool. And like I said, I, I prefer, prefer much more than the ginormous head of, of this Super 7 one. What the hell? Why is that so... Jesus Christ! <laughs> okay, and look, he, look at this. He's smaller, but my God! What in the hell was Super 7 thinking with that ginormous head? But this is, uh, yeah, this is much better. So, that's just a quick little, uh, unboxing of these two figures that... Yeah, like I said, I'm impressed with. I I am impressed with both of them. I like it. Again, it's I think this is a line that is probably going to sell really well at retail. It definitely should. Yeah. Oh, sorry. I was I was just I dozed off just looking at these. I I think it's good. He, he man's got a serious face. It's just I still think something with the eyes is just. I don't know, maybe at that angle it looks okay, but it kind of looks like when I'm looking at him, he's looking up. But he has a stern face. You know, he's he's got a stern face compared to, you know, whatever in the hell they were thinking on this one that they first released. Looks like he's trying to smile for Brom. This is horse shit. But this one, much better. I mean, he looks serious. So, that's it. But um, I'm going to do another unboxing tomorrow, and it's going to be something from uh, Tom Doolittle. He did something really cool, and man, I can't thank you enough for it. So I can't wait to see that and unbox it tomorrow. But hope you guys enjoyed that. Sorry I couldn't see any of the comments, but uh, all right. I'm going to get out of here right now. Until next time, have a powerful day.